So this move has been requested more than any other move that I do. And it looks like this. I'm glad to announce, I'm glad to announce that I will be releasing this move as part of like an actual like release, an actual uh, download type of thing. Uh, probably independently, but I'm, I'm welcome, I'm, you know, I'm open to offers, I'm open to... Uh, <laughs> I did try, I remember when I was really, really young, I tried to release this with Dan and Dave and they didn't even get back to me, so... Now I might do it independent, we'll see how it goes. Anyway, what's good peeps, it's your boy Edward Toda. And today we're going to be reacting to Koist the Kimla. I already know what it is based on the title. It's a trick that I've been working on for a very long time. I'm getting very, very close to be able, being able to perform this. I can probably perform this uh, right now. Um, I wouldn't do it on camera. It's not like anywhere close to this level. But in terms of, uh, you know, in terms of just to, to people, you know, at gigs and stuff like that, I actually think I could probably incorporate it into my, into my routine. Um, so I'll probably start doing that very soon. Uh, but yeah, man, Hoist is like, like a big inspiration for me. The dude does like pure sleight of hand, pure card stuff. It's awesome. Love his work. Let's check it out. Again with Kostya Kimlot, he is known as the business magician, entertaining audiences all across America. And right here at Walmart Live, he's been all wowing us all, all can morning. Hi, Kostya. Good think about it. his okay, so pin saying now, those beady I have to eyes. warn you, I'm going to watch really close okay. on this next one. That's what I want you to do that. Okay? Oh, I want you to watch mate. as closely as possible. I am obsessed with playing cards, okay? okay? I love the way they feel, the way they sound, the way they taste. Uh, okay, we all go there. <laughs> and, and you know, everyone shuffles cards differently, right? Yeah, In America, sure. this is the most popular type of shuffle, or riffle shuffle. Yes. I'm gonna ask you to do that for me if you would. Give them one of okay. those. I'm gonna make sure that you can do this perfectly for us. Yep. I've been wonderful. practicing with my kids for years. Oh, actually, so. good, that's the best way. There we way. go, maybe not Beautiful. as smooth as yours, but there you go. No, that was perfect. In fact, I want you to do it again. Okay. This time, when you separate them, turn one of the halves over. So turn one half face up. I love this up. presentation okay. for yeah. it. And now you're gonna like shuffle this. half the face up cards into the face down cards. It's exactly. gonna get all mixed up yeah. here. I mean, normally you don't do that, right? But as long as we don't push them in, then we're... <laughs> oh, sorry oh. about that. <laughs> okay, we'll do a different trick. We'll do a different trick. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. We'll do a different trick. Uh, first things first, you're fired. <laughs> no, okay, you know what? Actually, here, well, I'll tell you what. I got an idea, I got an idea. I think we can do this for you. Even though we've got this giant... They're all mixed up. Yeah, no, no, no. We're, don't even worry about the mess. You can see they're all mixed up here. Yes. I'm gonna have you pick a card from within this mess, okay? So what I want okay. you to do, and of course, I mean, face-up might be a little easy. So reach and take out a face-down cards for me. Any one you like. Right, you waiting for... Oh, that. there we go. Yeah. Okay, Grab one out. Got I want one. you to show it to the camera. Make sure they got it. Okay. Make sure they remember it. I won't look to make sure you guys got it. Interesting that way. Yep. He, like, and then it. I want you to sneak it when you're ready. Freestyle I want you to sneak it back into the deck. And you can put it in face up or face down. It's up okay, to you. So face you down, so you see it there up until the very last second, right? Right. Now, I want you to watch the cards closely. Some cards face up, some cards face down. We're going to place your hand like this and hang on to the cards. We're going to let them sit there. Okay. They're going to bake at room temperature right. for like 20 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> we'll speed it up for you. Ready? I appreciate it. It's done. And now every card in your hand is now the right way. What? Look, every card is now face up. Every single one except for one. <laughs> And hopefully, lucky for me, no, you're, that is no, yours. you're gonna yeah. be kidding me! <laughs> oh my gosh, how did there that you even you keep happen? those cards? That's my gift to you. How did that? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, Thank you. unbelievable. I mean, <laughs> who knew? Watch more holiday magic ahead here on Walmart Live. Stay with us. That was unbelievable. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> That's so mad. Like, because the, the thing is, I know, you know, I perform that, I know, I don't perform it yet, but I, I, I know the method behind everything, I understand how it works, and I can see him, like, cruising the lines as to, because he, he, in his DVD, he talks about the various, like, the different variations he has to performing this, and I can see him cruising between the lines, you know, like, he could have easily said, take one face up, or take, you know, any face up or face down, it doesn't matter, and in fact, he usually says that. But in this case, it actually made it a bit easier for him, if you know what I'm saying, for, for the guy to take a face down card. It would give him a bit more time. So, <laughs> he just like imp improvised as he went and, uh, you know, obviously he's a very high level guy, probably performed this, you know, I, I would have to say thousands of times or something. Uh, you know, he's definitely, like, he's definitely done this routine a lot. And so he understands like the little, like, every little, little aspect of it and uh, kind of can cruise through can cruise through the performances. I love that. But man, this is an effect that I saw years ago, years ago when I was looking for a triumph effect and people were saying, there's no better, there's no better triumph than Koista, Koista Kimlats. And I remember looking at it and I'm like, okay, I want to learn it. 
and I was, I was thinking I was gonna be able to do it within a week, you know. And uh, <laughs> when, I, when I really, really like saw how difficult it was, uh, I kind of got discouraged. But I kept practicing low key, you know, low key. I, I kept doing it, and uh, you know, over time, over time, I started getting you know more comfortable with it. I'm still nowhere near uh, that, but you know, like if you well, let me see if I can get this on camera. If you uh, take a look at these cards here, they can pick any card they want, and um, any card that they want to pick is, is is fine. So that was a little a little demo for you magicians. If you guys, uh, you know, you know what I'm talking about. Um, that's kind of where I'm at, but it will get better. And also, you know, the thing is, it's I, I do it very casually. I do it very. There's certain moves that I I'll practice just whenever I'm like I have nothing else to do. I'm at home or I'm like you know fidgeting. And so this is one of those moves. I, I call it a back burner, you know. There's, there's moves I get better at over long periods of time just because I, they're on the back burner. And I just do them every now and then. Um, but some moves, if they if I dedicate a lot of time to it, I can polish it up pretty quick. So I think if I did that with this move, I could get it quite good, this routine. Um, and that, I think that's the plan. But I have so many things to work on. I have so many routines and ideas <laughs> right now. But anyway, that's about it for this video. If you enjoyed it, do leave a like. Uh, it helps me out. You know, subscribe if you want to see more content like this. I do daily videos. Uh, follow me on all social, social me all social media platforms. I can't even speak. Uh, I had too much coffee as usual. Uh, <laughs> uh, so Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. All the links are down below. Do go follow my Instagram if you're not followed already. I'm trying to reach 10k subs so I can get the uh, 10k followers so I can get a swipe up feature. Um, currently at 2.2k or something like that. So we're, we're gonna grind that. We're gonna grind that out. Don't worries. No worries. But uh, here we go. What am I saying? I'm way too hopped up, up on coffee. Anyway, that's about it for me. If you enjoyed this video, God damn it, I said that. Anyway, as always, mad respect, much love, stay lit, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace!